Morning folks, I'm going to fly one here, a uh, buddy of mine there, Steve, making out down in, uh, down in the States there, asked me if I had any good patterns for, for pike. Uh, I have a brother that used to guide in, in northern Saskatchewan for pike, and uh, this is a fly I used to tie for him all the time to take up there with him, uh, and he done done well with it, so I figured I'd tie a few for you, uh, Steve, and see what you think. Um, here it is here. It's just called a black bunny, and uh, very good fly. So here we go, Steve. I'll uh, see what I can do for you. Start with a this is a 33.99 um, three aught hook. It's uh, it's rather large. Um, this is a same hook in a 14. So you can see it's quite the size of a hook. And I start by uh, putting down uh, just some soft lead wrapped, wrapped around. And this is uh, Kevlar, by the way. Same thing to make a uh, bulletproof vest out of. Secure that in nice and tight. in a set of these dumbbell eyes for a little extra added weight Figure eight them in and secure them. And then this fly is tied with soccer strip or um, rabbit strip, strips of rabbit fur. And uh, quite effective. Gives a lot of a lot of movement in the water, a lot of nice action. So we pick out a nice piece here and Start by putting on our tail. Start our tail, what we do is separate it like this, lay it on the hook, and tie it in right there, right where it separates. And out so much. Out so much. I'll tie it down again. And this helps bind it in really well. I'm going to tie back over it right back to where you started. Like so. And I put in a few pieces of black crystal flash. I've got them or so. And all I do is Start and tie them in on one side, like so, and then just simply bring them across and tie them in on the other side. And they ain't going to pull out then. And the body, the body is wrapped out of this uh, Chanel, Sparkle Chanel. It's it's um, kind of a peacock color or a black peacock I guess you'd call it I'm going to come up about halfway and bind that in just 
stroke it back according to you. Wrap it. So, now you use the same material to the rabbit strip and you use it like you would a hackle and you wrap it around. I always just tear off a bit to tie it in like so. Just pull that off and save this because you can use it as a dubbing. And tie it in, get it on the side. Now, once you get that done, you can take a bit of the stuff you just tore off that I said you're going to save for a dubbing and spin it on to your thread for dubbing. Just use that to uh, in and around them eyes, like so. Now, take your rabbit strip and start wrapping around like you're just the same as your hackle on the floor, like so. You could leave it at that, or you could just put one more wrap in front, like so. Wind that up. Finish that up. A couple of coats of head cement. You got the finish floor. There you go, Steve. I uh, hope that's uh, that'll do you for a pike fly. Uh, say hi to Brody for me. All right, thanks. Thanks for watching.